911. What city is your emergency in? I'm in Cleveland, uh, right on like South Point and Marvin, and there's such a big fire. Sunday night, a large fire swept through a section of storefronts on West 25th Street in Cleveland, near the campus of Metro Health Medical Center. A team of nearly 70 Cleveland firefighters battled the two alarm blaze for hours. Investigators say they were making good progress in knocking down the fire and keeping the flames from spreading to a neighboring gas station when a water main break suddenly depleted the water that was being fed to two hydrants they were using. The flames then sparked up again and firefighters had to use additional fire companies to relay water to the scene. Neighborhood residents say they are grateful for the effort to protect them and their homes. I was thinking, I hope that fire doesn't come over by this gas station and blow it up because that will take out this whole neighborhood right here. One of the businesses that was destroyed in the fire was Gargano's Restaurant and Catering, which has been a fixture on West 25th Street for decades. The restaurant became a symbol of perseverance in professional wrestling circles. For those familiar with the life story of WWE wrestler Johnny Gargano, who grew up in Cleveland. Johnny Gargano revealed over the years that he was told that he was not big enough to make it in pro wrestling, but said the lessons he learned from his father and the family restaurant inspired him to keep trying. And earlier this summer, he became a world tag team champion. In a post on social media, Johnny Gargano wrote, quote, I know a lot of wrestling fans were looking forward to going to my dad's restaurant when they were in Cleveland for SummerSlam. I'm grateful that my dad was not there and is okay. He is 82 years old. This is his life's work. He has worked in that building every day for almost 50 years. I basically grew up there, and now it's just gone. It is extremely heartbreaking for my family. Jack Shea, Fox 8 News in Cleveland.